these fucking people, these hypocrites of the highest order, need to be stopped. As a matter of fact, we need to slice in a little full stop, not a comma, so that they continue the sh. I get any feeling that you're fucking sensing me. I'm hearing the beep. Is that a beep? Fuck. Is that a beep? Listen to me. I am a big panty woman. They say no small cat out there. You're dealing with Mufasa. Do not censor me. We're not going on national TV yet. You hear me? This is YouTube. You are allowed to say fuck. It means for unlawful carnal knowledge. We shorten it to fuck which. You know what damn well I mean. Let my words run. It's for context. We don't just fuck just so. After all, I'm not the Prime Minister. When we touch them, the whole place shell up. When we touch them, the whole place shell up. Hello, how you going? You good? You miss me? This thing kind of. I miss you too. So, straight it. Um, it's take a lot to pull me out. Because. Honestly, I does not have the zeal, you know, the zeal, is it zeal, the zeal, the... I can't say the motivation, all right, the zeal to do these fucking vid blogs. Everybody's be like, Rachel, when is the next vid blog? Rachel, when is the next vid blog? When I feel, and these days I feel, let me step aside from the politics for one second because that's a nasty sledgehammer that I'm ready to swing. And let us discuss my childhood. When I was a child, and I had a beautiful childhood, God bless my ancestors, God bless my grandmother and my great-grandmother. When I was a child, I had animals, birds. We didn't like cats. We had dogs. Countless dogs. I mean, I'm trying to really put a figure on how many dogs we had, and I can't. But I had a personal dog, my baby doggy. And his name was Whiskey. They named him Whiskey because he was black and white. So I guess it was a playoff or a pun on, you know, the, the alcohol, Whiskey. Black and white, all right, black and white. So whiskey was my baby. And I had whiskey from maybe the age of four or five till I was nine or 10, maybe even 11, because whiskey died just before common entrance results came out. Them days it was still called common entrance. The moral of the story, I loved my dogs. I love dogs still. I have two beautiful Maltese that are running about somewhere right now. So in this country of Trinidad and Tobago, we know dogs as not pets alone, but friends of the family. Dogs are family. We don't know nothing about eating dog. Yeah. Some disturbing footage make the news. Now when you see in footage being bantered on, you know, thrown about on social media, we don't really take it on. You see when it hit the seven o'clock news? An hour before my dinner time and my stomach is upset. This is not a diet, you know, this is the seven o'clock news. Upsetting my stomach every night. So we will just look at the footage of a dog being skinned by a China fella, a Chinese fella, and not no local Chinese. Citizens are today being urged to exercise extreme caution when purchasing food from Chinese restaurants. A recent video posted to social media of what appears to be a Chinese national skinning a dog near a food establishment in Diego Martin has caused public concern. Today, Health Minister Dr. Fuad Khan said he was horrified by the video but not surprised. I realize that the amount of stray dogs in this country have disappeared 
and also you don't see them in a pound, so they have to be going somewhere. So I have been very particular because I know in China, rats are eaten, dogs are eaten, and so to cats and other things. And the Chinese government is, is coming down on quite a few of those, um, those people, uh, other people doing it. Dr. Khan says it seems migrant Chinese nationals have brought some of their culture to this country, but there is little that can be done to stop it. He says the present Food and Drug Act addresses the importation of food items, but it does not cover issues like this. When you mix meat with, with MSG, that's in it, and you soften the meat, you will the taste will change as well as the actual meat consistency and it will look like beef or pork or something. So one has to be extremely astute to, for what they're eating and they won't be able to tell half the time. My question is, where he get the dog? Who missing the pet all over the Gomatan and I've been saying for quite some time all over the Gomatin, you only see a flyer in the grocery, in the pharmacy. Different poles when you're running past. Dog missing. Shiva, Shiva, all kind of dog. Rooster, Rover, dog missing. Family friend, family pet, missing. Well, now we know fucking why. It bothering me. It really bothering me. Because... A few years ago, about three years ago, we had an incident of suspicious meat. TNT, nobody and asked these bitches what they suspect the meat of doing. But I'll play it. No, no, no. Don't laugh. I'm very fucking serious. Nobody asked them a question. They shut down a Chinese restaurant in Curep. It was open within three days. And the report in the papers is they shut them down for suspicious meat. The first time I ever hear the term suspicious meat. And nobody has say what they suspect was in that fucking freezer. You hear me? So it could be human parts, they say. It could be other than dog, it could be cat, they say. And while many men will relish the thought of eating cat, not me. A little kinky, but... It's only so far the lesbian in me is rise. Who is missing the pet? Better than that, where is immigration? Does this man have a passport? It have a set of bitches walking around the country, not speaking English. But they have ID card. And once you have an ID card, T and T, once you have an ID card, you're allowed to vote. Tell me that I wrong. These bitches real. You is eating dog and telling me that is not for my consumption as a consumer. How am I supposed to know who the fuck does the tech what in a pow? So it could be chasu pump back for all I care. All I know. Something is very, very wrong and nobody has locked down these bitches yet they're still operating. Because all they selling dream. If I go on for chicken and get canine, something wrong. That is not thievery. That is not bubble. That is not some sort of scandal. That is not giving me food under false pretense. I don't want nothing back in, in my box. That is why I just only buy thing with wing. You right to laugh. I just only buy thing with wing because it had, it had to imitate wing. The flapper on the fowl, it had. You can't take mistake or dog poor for that at all. Nah, man. We have to do something about this. What are we saying? And you know, people still going in there with their wicked self and order in power. So they ain't care. They ain't care. So, so what? There's an assault on my senses. There's not abuse. Well, you could charge them with. Huh? Nobody, no man. I guess if, if it was a famous dog, if they could kill fucking Lassie or something, so we'd make an uproar, but something has to be done. So other than the police, where is the Dalai Loom? All you know about them? Them is the people who in charge of all the halal rights and Muslim rights as far as blessing the chicken and, you know, when you see a sign, 
this meat is halal, it is authorized by the Dalai Loom. And they, you know, they call the shots as far as chicken, especially the Arawak and who else? Neutral mix and all these people concerned. So where them people because they need to be asking some questions or they're losing revenue. Right? Where them priests and them nobody in up in arms. I tell you, something is very wrong with the way we balance and we belly these days. Let me know what I eaten. Don't just hand me dog. You understand? In Trinidad, we want to eat everything. Once it's moving, we want to curry it. I understand. People as eat curry cro crocodile or curry gate. Wait, this gator or caiman. Right? That your guts. I understand, you feel free. I have a big Sawati partner who went bishops, and every year, I, you know, you know me and my bishop story, I don't go that fit. But every year she's come with a big bishop's accent. Rachel, you don't know what you're missing. I love the Jiro horse. We eat in fucking horse. When I see the advertising horse in the fit, I say, are you crazy? Horse, me say, you know. Rachel, you don't know what you're missing, darling. Darling, let me just tell you, the horse is wonderful. I mean, they blend it up so well, I'm even considering it, you know, as an alternative to beef. Let me help you out, eh, darling. I will not be eating horse. I watched too much Indian movie as a child, with your hair blowing in the breeze and you're galloping on the sea. You understand me? With a horse. I have a connection to Mr. Ed. Remember he? I like horses. To know that you put a horse down in a pot with Shadow Benny and Jira affecting my spirit as a person. Forget training because we will eat anything. But I am not eating dog and horse. These are friends. I like a little girl now. You, a matter of fact, I... It's, it's, you could say it's hunting season over. You could say you, you, you have gone, huh? Me? Oh, good God. Aaron, you're not no help. Listen to me. And this is my story, and I'm sticking to it. A guana walk in my house. The guana was a jihadist. He wanted to die. He chose his suicide. He is now safely in my freezer, waiting on the wali. Or Eid, or. He waited. Right? That corner died for a cause. I understand that. We go eat corner. But not horse and dog. Where are we going? I really feel the average training up for dog, you know. I they, they we go try anything. Just now, they're gonna start to curry fucking rat. I'm telling you. Is anything? Is anything? Yeah, then they had some crystallized bugs that they had some in some fair where they dip in um, roaches and bug and thing that they find all about caterpillar and thing and crystallized honey and sugar. Did you hear me? There is crystallizing cockroach and giving people who and telling you try it, try it. I suppose it's the accent. Yeah, no. Well, yeah, I, I know where we reach. Wherever we reach, I want to come off this bus. Eat. Eat food, training food, known globally. Known globally, known worldwide. For being delicacies as it stands. But not horse and dog. I ain't going down that road. TNT know what you're doing, eh? And do what you know. Bless. Kaim smile. Bless. Bless. Boom! When we touch down, the whole place shall long. When we touch down, the whole place shall